Look, I'm so worried about you right now. The savings rate this month hit a low of 2.7%. This is a unbelievable and ridiculous warning sign that I told you about last week. The person that has $236. Invest it all in yourself. You're already broke. Don't hold on to $236. Our parents, they taught us to save money. You know? Yeah, this 100%. I want to bank cash, man. I need money. I need emergency funds. A safety net is one of the first goals any investor should establish in the fund. We recommend that everyone should save regularly towards some kind of safety net. It just doesn't make any sense. Save your money. Prepare for a rainy day. It fucking don't rain here. I need to treat money like it's sacred. The savings rate in this country was over 6.5% for 30 years. Now it's collapsed again. What are you doing? I'll never forget, these guys pay $12,000 each to sit in that chair. Three days, I got to look at their ugly faces. Look, man, you're spending money on junk when you don't need it. Look at my little, look at my little, my little things, man. I got, I know guys walking around with five and $600 headphones, and I got my little freebies that came, came with my phone. Why? What's the difference? So this is a 13-passenger Gulfstream. Uh, it retails for about $61 million. Truth is, most people don't like money. I know they don't like money. You know how I know they don't like money? Because as soon as you get some, you get rid of it. You buy shit with it. I mean, it's crazy. When you start putting stuff on a jet, it's bizarre. Like this door was not in here. This door right here, believe it or not, costs $850,000 to put in. America is back to the savings rate that it was at back when we had this problem in 2008. When people were buying Porsches, and cars, and country clubs. Dude, it's, it was out of hand. Uh, 10 years ago, all they used in these planes was really dark, heavy wood. Um, probably cost a million dollars to replace the wood. You know, my father told me, when I was six years old, he said, watch the pennies, the dollars will take care of themselves. Okay, help me out here. A penny saved is? A penny is a penny. Okay, your mama got real complicated here. A penny is a penny, and if you spend time with them, you'll end up with nothing. When you watch pennies and nickels and dimes and quarters, when you watch that, you're going to pay attention to the bigger flows. People that are not disciplined with money don't end up with money. People that waste money on dumb things don't end up with money. There's something universal about money. Waste it, somebody else gets it. So if you're down to your last $1,000, this, yeah. this offer today is $9.97, grantcardone.com forward slash shark. Okay? Yeah. You're down, a guy's sitting there right now watching this and I'm, I got my last grand, dude, and I got Christmas coming. Should he spend it on this? Absolutely. I would tell you the same thing.